welcome to Learning Bricks CAD. In this lesson we're going to be exploring options for printing your designs. Right clicking in the graphics window and using the quad cursor we can start the print command and when I do that you'll notice the print model dialog box comes up so we're currently in model space there's no page set up to find here we're going to select a print as PDF for the printer plotter configuration and let's place it on a architectural D size sheet of paper leaving the plot area at view plot scales currently fit print area and we'll go ahead and center it on the sheet notice how plot scale is currently set to fit and if we do a preview the previewing application for the PDF file, whichever is on your computer, will open up a preview of this particular print. And as you can see, it's an exact representation of the view. We can zoom in and out. You've got basic PDF controls. Closing this application and returning to BricsCAD, we're going to explore in this lesson ways of printing or different methods of printing the same geometry. So now let's take a look at changing the plot area to extents and clicking preview and now you'll notice a completely different view on the sheet. So in this case the entire extents of the drawing that is the represented by the objects on the further most outside parts of the drawing are calculated and that area is printed. Let's take a look at the window option. If I click that and then choose the select area to be printed, I can define the window area that I want to select and I can be very accurate about it using entity snaps. And again, you'll notice that that exact area is placed on the sheet, in this case, filling up the sheet. So let's close this tab or the uh, viewing application and uncheck the fit print area to size of paper or size of page and let's set a specific scale factor of one and a half inches equals a foot and click preview again this is a D size sheet of paper so note the difference now this is an exact scale of the geometry at the scale selected changing the paper size Let's choose an ANSI B 11 by 17 inches and again click preview. Again notice the difference. Now we're, now we're printing to a B size sheet. Next we'll click the print button and create the PDF file. Switching over to Unit Plan. Next, we'll click the File menu. Again, choose Print. And this time, then select the ANSI Expanded B 17 by 11 with a scale of 1 to 1 and click Preview. Review the results. And we'll go ahead and click this as well. Click print and create the PDF file. Okay, continuing to demonstrate print options or printing uh, functionality. Moving over to the first floor plan layout and then we're going to execute the print command. This time we will change the paper size to be equal to an architectural 
expanded D. Notice that we're set to print the layout at a one-to-one -one scale and click print. So the file name for the PDF is automatically created. Click save. And then if I wanted to view that drawing, I would just go back to the folder and access that PDF. At this point, it could be shared with others, be sent to a printer, or emailed. Moving back to the print command, this time we're going to assign a page setup name, PDF 11 by 17, and then you'll notice the paper size, the plot area, the plot scale, all of those properties are automatically assigned to this layout now for the purpose of printing. So rather than change each of these options individually, I can select a page setup and apply them all at once. Clicking print here will print that PDF. And again, the title name is automatically placed. And that completes our lesson on printing in BricsCAD.